Do you have low Iman, but you don't know why? You'll want to watch this video until the very end. The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, was once delivering a speech, and a caravan of music and entertainment came into the city. This grabbed the attention of the companions to the point where they left the Prophet to go to it in the middle of his speech. Shocking, right? They left the remembrance of Allah to go to the remembrance of the dunya. But what you might not realize is that this exact same caravan exists with us to this day. Our phones, social media, Netflix, and the list goes on. You see, the heart is like a vessel. What you fill it with determines the level of your Iman. You either fill it with the remembrance of Allah, which makes your Iman go up, or you fill it with the remembrance of the dunya, which makes your Iman go down. And since we live in a time where these caravans are designed to be so addictive, we find ourselves distracted pretty much all day without realizing. How many times have you opened TikTok and accidentally spent hours on the For You page? How many times throughout the day do you reach for your phone to check it, and sometimes for no reason? It's gotten to the point where we're literally at the caravan all day, every day. This has silently pushed the remembrance of Allah out of our hearts, leaving us confused as to why our Iman is so low, why the quality of our worship has gone down, and why we feel so insensitive. So for that, the solution is very simple. We must discipline ourselves and step away from the caravan. If we choose not to, and to make our life about entertainment and joy, Allah promises us in the Qur'an a depressing and miserable life. If however we discipline ourselves, limit our entertainment, and remember Allah frequently, then أَلَا بِذِكْرِ اللَّهِ تَطْمَئِنُّ الْقُلُوبِ Surely, in the remembrance of Allah, do hearts find peace. That's your solution.